U.S. Congress members are on Maui to assess how much federal funding is still needed for wildfire recovery. The feds have already pitched in nearly $3 billion. Our Chelsea Davis reports from today's congressional field hearing. To many people. Federal lawmakers traveled to Lahaina to hear directly from community members about its ongoing needs more than a year after the horrific wildfires. This will be a need that probably goes on six years here. Federal officials relate to the Subcommittee on Government Operations and the Federal Workforce that residential debris removal is now complete and commercial debris removal is expected to wrap up in February. Progress with still a long way to go. By having the debris removed within a year for residential, the water systems back operational because of EPA's work and the Corps' work and, uh, and all the sewer systems. So we're ready for the infrastructure. We're ready for the community to build. What's lacking is that federal funding to help the rebuilding. Hawaii Congresswoman Jill Takuda stressed the importance of undergrounding utility lines and widening roads and building permanent housing in the area. In many ways, this fire ripped back the curtain for how we have struggled to just survive here in Hawaii from a housing perspective. Maui County Mayor Richard Bissing got emotional at times as he testified about residents who've been forced to move away because of Maui's high cost of living. And even one more family lost is one too many. He says the county will release a draft plan for Lahaina's long-term recovery in October. Hawaii Congressman Ed Case says the federal government has already spent approximately $3 billion on the disaster. He says much more must be done. The first and foremost thing we have to do is to replenish the disaster relief fund um, as soon as possible. And we have asked for that in the tune of 209 Billion dollars. Number two, uh, we need to fund the Community Development Block Grant Disaster Relief Fund. This is what we need and will access in order to actually rebuild Lahaina. They hope lessons learned on Maui will help the nation better respond to future disasters. Chelsea Davis, Hawaii News Now.